The name of chapter is circle. Standard 10, 9, CBSE. Subject mass, okay? Now see, in this chapter, what we are going to learn? We are going to learn about circle. And term related to circle. And some of its property. Three things we are going to learn. What do you mean by circle? Terms related to circle and some properties of those terms and circles. First of all, what is circle? Circle is a the collection of all points in a plane which are at a fixed distance from a fixed point. Set of all points in a plane which are at a fixed distance from fixed point. Fixed point is called center of the circle and fixed distance is called radius of the circle. Okay? So now I write the definition of circle. The collection of all points In a, in a plane, which are equidistance from a fixed point. is called the collection of all points in a plane which are at a equal distance from a fixed point is called circle. The fixed point is called center of the circle. The center of the circle And that constant distance or fixed distance from fixed point is called radius of the circle. Now see the figure. If I draw a circle, it is like this. Okay? This is a fixed point. We call it as a center of circle. And this fixed distance, OP. OP. OP is called R, radius. O is the center of the circle. And OP is called radius of the circle. O is the, OP is R is called radius. And O is the center. Center of circle. Okay? Clear? Now in daily life we can see many objects which are round in shape. Clear? What are those bangles? Have you seen bangles? See, this bangle is circular in shape. Wheel of a car or scooter, right, rings, okay, keys, key, key rings hoti hai na, key rings and many more things. The circle divide the plane, this circle you see, divide the plane into three parts. Number one, inside the circle, on the circle and outside the circle, clear? Inside of circle is called interior of circle. Circle matlab on the circle, the points, set of points on the circle. And outside the circle matlab outside of the circle. That is called exterior of the circle, okay? So I can say circle divide the plane into 
into three parts. Number one. Inside the circle, call interior of circle. If you take any point, this is a circle with the center. If you take P is any point on the circle, hmm, then OP is less than R. If OP less than R, matlab it implies P belongs to interior of circle, okay? Second, circle. Matlab, if OP is equal to R, then it implies P is on the circle. Okay? And third is outside of circle. Called exterior of circle. मतलब ये P is somewhere here. Then this OP is greater than R. So if OP is greater than R, that implies P belongs to exterior of circle. This sign is belongs to. P belongs to exterior of circle. P lies on the exterior of circle. So, circle divide into three parts. And the circle and its interior together make a circular region. Circle and interior of circle together. Interior of circle together. Called a circular region. Circular region. Okay? Clear? Now we are talking about the terms related to circle. First one is chord. What do you mean by chord? Second is diameter. What do you mean by diameter? Why I have written both together? Because sir, chord and diameter are related with each other. A biggest chord of circle we call it as a diameter. Now what is the chord? The line segment. Segment. Joining any two point of circle. Joining any two point of circle points of circle is called chord of circle. See in the figure, suppose this is a circle, okay? This is a center O. Now suppose A and B are any two point of a circle and the line segment joining this A and B so here AB is called chord of a circle. Any two point of circle. You join them by a line segment. Then AB is a chord. Okay. And if I don't put bar over AB, then it represents the length of the chord. Chord ke liye upar bar rakhna jaruri hai. Okay. Now, what do you mean by diameter? The chord passing through the center of the circle. Suppose this is my PQ is a chord. But it is a special chord passing through center of the circle. Then it is called the diameter of circle. Okay. So the chord passes through the center. 
the center of circle. Cord passes through the center of circle. Each cord diameter. Diameter of a circle. And there are many diameter we can construct, okay? In figure, A, B, or P, Q, sorry. In figure, P, Q is a diameter. And you see, the diameter is a biggest chord. Diameter is the biggest chord. Diameter is a biggest chord. इससे बड़ा कॉर्ड होता नहीं है, ओके? ये जो बिगेस्ट कॉर्ड है, एंड डायमीटर इज, डायमीटर इज टू टाइम रेडियस, क्लियर? सी, पी क्यू इज ओ पी प्लस ओ क्यू, सो इट इज टू टाइम रेडियस, क्लियर? सो आर यू क्लियर? विथ कॉर्ड एंड डायमीटर, नाउ वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट आर्क, ओके? What do you mean by arc of circle? Suppose this is a circle. Okay? O is the center. PQ is a chord. Okay? Then in between my R lay loom. So this part or this curve PRQ. This curve PRQ. We call it as a arc of a circle. It is a piece of circle. Piece of a circle. PRQ is a piece of a circle. Between piece of circle between two points. Two points P and Q. A piece of circle between two points of a circle is called an arc of circle. Okay. In figure, the longer one, suppose this is PRQ and this is PLQ. So, Longer one, longer part is called major arc. So here P L R is major arc and the smaller one, the smaller one what is a smaller one? Smaller one is PRQ. Is minor arc. Okay? And when diameter I draw diameter, suppose a PQ or suppose this PQ is a diameter. Okay? If PQ is diameter, diameter then it divides the circle then it divides circle into two arc it divides circle into two parts two parts each part is called semicircle what is called each part is called semicircle semi-circle. So, here both arc are of equal length. Right? Both arc are of equal length. Each part of the circle we call it as a semi-circle. And the length of complete circle, the length of complete circle is called perimeter or circumference of the circle. Length of complete circle. 
is called what we call perimeter or circumference of the circle perimeter or circumference of circle clear circumference of the circle बराबर First we are discussing about segment. Segment मतलब the region between a chord and either of its arc. The region between between the chord chord and either of its either of its arc it may be major arc or minor arc is called segment if it is with minor arc it is called minor segment if it is with major arc it is major segment here also there are two type here also there are two type आर्क में टू टाइप है वैसे सेगमेंट में भी टू टाइप वन इज माइनर सेगमेंट एंड अदर इज मेजर सेगमेंट देखो माइनर सेगमेंट मतलब इफ आई ड्रॉ सर्कल हियर ओके एन आई ड्रॉ सर्कल हियर ऑल्सो लुक हियर दिस इफ दिस इज अ सर्कल विथ सेंटर ओ ओके एंड सपोज पी क्यू इज अ कॉड सो जो ऊपर का है ना वो है मेजर सेगमेंट राइट दिस इज अ मेजर सेगमेंट ओके एंड दिस इज अ माइनर सेगमेंट क्लियर दिस इज अ माइनर सेगमेंट राइट एंड ऊपर वाला है वो मेजर सेगमेंट ओके एक ही फिगर में दोनों बता दिए मैंने ओके ये फिगर ड्रॉ करने की जरूरत नहीं है राइट द रीजन बिटवीन कॉर्ड एंड आइदर ऑफ इट्स आर्क इज कॉल सेगमेंट सो रीजन बिटवीन कॉर्ड एंड माइनर आर्क इज माइनर सेगमेंट एंड रीजन बिटवीन कॉर्ड एंड मेजर आर्क इज कॉल्ड मेजर सेगमेंट Are you clear? Now we are talking about sector. What is difference between segment and sector? Segment is region between chord and arc, and sector is region between arc and two corresponding radii. Okay. So the region between. arc and two radii joining the centers joining the centers center to the end points of arc end points of an arc each called sector here also there are two sector minor sector and 
मेजर सेक्टर सपोज आई ड्रॉ अ सर्कल ओके बिग सर्कल दिस इज अ सेंटर सपोज दिस माय पी क्यू इज एन आर्क दिस पी क्यू इज एन आर्क देन द एंड पॉइंट ऑफ आर्क आर जॉइंट विथ सेंटर ओ इज अ सेंटर देन दिस पोर्शन दिस रीजन बिटवीन आर्क एंड टू रेडिया दिस पोर्शन इज कॉल सेक्टर बट दिस इज विथ माइनर आर्क सो इट इज कॉल माइनर सेक्टर एन ऊपर वाला जो है वो मेजर सेक्टर क्लियर क्लियर सॉरी क्लियर अबाउट सेक्टर मेजर आर्क करस्पॉन्ड्स मेजर सेक्टर एंड माइनर आर्क करस्पॉन्ड माइनर सेक्टर ओके मेजर आर्क करस्पॉन्ड मेजर सेक्टर मेजर सेक्टर एंड माइनर आर्क करस्पॉन्ड माइनर सेक्टर If two arcs are equal, that is each arc a semicircle, right? Then both segments and both sectors become the same. Clear? Suppose this is a circle, the center O, and suppose AB is a diameter. Then they are each part is called semicircle. So here. Both the segments and both the sector are same, clear? Because arc and two radii is also this semicircle, means this part, and chord and arc also subtend same region. So if two arcs are equal, here both arcs are equal. Arc APB and Arc AQB both are equal. Okay, that is each one is a semicircle. That is each one is a semicircle. Then both segment, then both segment. And both sector are same. Both sector becomes the same. Sector bolo ya segment bolo, ek hi rahega. Becomes the same. And each is called, each is called semicircular region. What is called? semicircular region here this region is called each one this up, upper upper side or lower side each one is called semicircular region what is called semicircular region clear clear That complete your different types of different terms of circle. This is basic. I have given the introduction of circle, and here I have discussed about circle, different terms of circle, and next time we are going to learn their properties also. Some properties I have included in discussion, but some special. properties and theorems we will do it in next lecture okay